Now, let us see some examples on how America has freed the English language from the stifling tyranny of the passive voice. Now we can see a textbook from the second paragraph, second line, where we would say ceremoniously trespassing prohibited. Now here, ceremoniously means decorating something with flowers. Okay, now why do we use flowers to decorate? Because uh, in, in order to make it look more beautiful right so ceremoniously means adding flowers or decorating to make it more uh, look more beautiful so where one used to say ceremoniously trespassing prohibited now here trespassing means to enter someone's territory without taking permission and prohibited means not allowed okay so this instead of saying trespassing prohibited one could have just said trespassing to this place is not allowed right so the writer he is trying to say that rather than using much difficult words what do the signboards say? The signboards, okay, as he noticed, in the parks of Berkeley, merely say, newly planted, don't walk, or absolutely no parking, which leaves no room for speculation, and motorists need not spend too much time peering out and setting the notice. So here, what he says, the word trespassing prohibited. He means to say that it is used to make it look beautiful. Okay, to this are flowery, flowery language. It means um, in order to make it look beautiful or sound beautiful. But he says, uh, uh, Arkinaran says that he noticed that in the signboard it says, Simple words, okay, in America, okay, this, uh, this word, simple words were written. Now here, the meaning of merely say means, simply says, newly planted, don't walk. Now here, these are easy to understand, right? It means that these plants inside the park are newly planted, so don't walk on that. This is what it means, right? People can easily understand. Or, we can also say, absolutely no parking, means it's understood that absolutely no parking. So, this word, by using such words, it leaves no room for speculation. Speculation means any doubt, okay? There is no possibility of being doubtful. The people will not be in doubt understanding the meaning. And motorists need not to spend too much peering out and setting the notice. So, motorists means um, those people who are driving a vehicle. Now, these people will not spend too much time peering out means looking out and studying the notice studying the notice means trying to understand what is written so by this Arkinaran says that rather than using very beautiful flowery flowery language in America simple language is used simple instructions are written in the board I'm oh, sorry on the board which make it easier to for the people to understand and they do not have to waste too much time in understanding what is written. A very clear message is conveyed through the, through the, uh, through the simplest language, that is by using simple language.